This exhibition at Galerie Nathalie Obadia, Brussels, presents a selection of paintings and works on paper made since 2015. I tend to work in series which explore the possibilities of abstraction with distinct sets of ideas governing the making of the paintings. So this exhibition in Brussels shows several paintings from each series made in recent years. The exhibition begins on the first floor of the gallery with paintings from the grayscale, figure and pastel series. I have arranged the work so that as the viewer comes up the stairs into the space, there is a chromatic shift through a sequence from light to dark. The first painting that one sees is a large-scale pastel series, landscape format painting, titled Such Stuff as Dreams Are Made On, which is a quote from Shakespeare. I eliminated any use of black or grey in my colour palette for this series, so that the resulting painting has an ethereal and somewhat otherworldly presence, a landscape full of fleeting figures and incidents which drift in and out of the shifting ground whilst remaining decidedly abstract. To the left is a group of small grayscale paintings using black, white and grey tones to suggest heads or portraits composed only of abstract brush marks. At the end of the gallery, figure 2D represents a return to the use of colour against a stormy grey ground. This fairy tale figure, which might be wearing a headdress or a necklace or shoes, merges into and out of the blurred ground and yet exists as a collection of abstract brush marks. On the second floor of the gallery, I'm showing paintings from the abstract series and the new word series, alongside a selection of works on paper. In 2019, I began the abstract series with the intention to abandon all deliberate references to the figurative. I wasn't trying to conjure up a figure or a landscape or a still life. The brush marks are intended to represent only themselves. However, the impossibility of a pure and hermetic visual abstraction is revealed as the painterly forms inevitably evoke references and the suggestion of an imaginary field of activity. The two most recent paintings from 2021, And Nothing Is But What Is Not, and Yes, I'm Alone, But I'm Alone and Free, are from the current word series, which enacts the titles of the paintings over the surface of the canvas. The brush marks and shapes form letters and sentences with differing degrees of legibility and clarity, merging the languages of art with those of literature and popular culture. I chose titles from a wide range of sources which mean something to me personally. For example, Shakespeare, Studio Ghibli, films, metaphysical poetry and pop music, so that within the same group of paintings there are pointers to a myriad of influences and states of mind. The paintings are intended to resist immediate narrative, whilst remaining mysterious and abstract.